What's up you guys? Welcome back to my channel. I know it has been a hot minute since I vlogged and by the time you are watching this video, by the time I put this video out, y'all will understand why I have been MIA from vlogging or me, you know, creating videos, whatever. Girl, let me update you. So, I am pregnant! So, I can't believe I'm saying that out loud. That's like, uh, I don't know. Just, I don't know. It just makes me nervous and shy. And I don't know, just by saying that. I'm like, toda nerviosa over here. <laughs> but anyways, I, right now, I am currently on my way to my first prenatal visit. And uh, so yeah, that's why we have this. That's why I'm in my car driving. So yeah, guys, I'm on my way. And I'm so nervous. Bray did not get to make it with me today because if you live in Texas, you know it has been a crazy rainy season already. And it's been raining like crazy. So they get, um, what do you call them? They get rain out. <laughs> Brain fart. So they get rain out so they don't get to work as much whenever it rains a lot. So yeah, so since he's been off a lot, I just we decided that I will come to my first visit by myself unfortunately but I will be recording everything for him to see and I'll be sending everything to him and all that stuff so it's like he's really there but you know usually by the first visit they really don't do much besides confirm that you are pregnant but also I don't know exactly what we're gonna do today because according to my app I'm actually about 12 weeks already but I don't know how accurate that is because it is just kind of like a guess. It goes by your last menstrual cycle and with the uh, ultrasound that they do or whatever, uh, they should be able to tell you how far you are. Even if it's not like 100%, it's a little bit more accurate compared to my app. But yeah, so I'm approximately already 12 weeks, so three months, which is crazy to think about it. But it's just... I don't know it's just so crazy <laughs> but yeah guys I'm on my way I'm so excited I think I've already said that like 20 times but I'm just so excited I'm finally get to go see this little jelly bean to see what size he or she is I'm so excited so why I have been in my is because I have been so nauseous I have really bad indigestion I think that's how it's called like heartburn and acid reflux like it's been so bad I've been so sick I actually took off a week um, for uh, vacation and it was just a random week that I told my manager like hey you know I just need a week off whatever didn't do anything según yo it's just to be at home with Zeke and I was actually freaking dying I was so so sick I was so congested I don't know like a really cold really bad case of a cold I don't know whatever was in the air and whatever the rain brought in so I was so so sick that entire week of my vacation to Wunyo and uh, yeah that drainage did not help at all with my nauseousness if that's even a word it was it's just been really bad so this pregnancy has definitely been really really tough compared to my first pregnancy it's been and I know it's there's worse I know people have nausea a lot worse than I do but girl, I feel like this, just having both of them combined, like the acid reflux makes me have nausea. It makes me want to vomit because it's just la comida or whatever just stays there, you know, like the taste. I don't know. So yeah, it's definitely been pretty, I felt like, I feel like it's been pretty rough. But slowly, I feel like I'm getting better. I just feel like everything that I eat just gives me acid reflux or heartburn and this early i'm just like so shook like i had pretty bad heartburn with heartburn with zeke uh but that was i feel like in the second trimester at least midway or maybe towards the end and this is like still like in the first trimester like how is it that i have it this bad already like this baby better come out looking like a chewbacca with a lot of hair <laughs> because 
this heartburn has been so bad so I did tough it out with Zeke throughout my entire pregnancy it sucked but I was able to do it so I'm hoping to do the same thing with this baby but it's just different when it's combined with nausea like it's just like two, 20 times worse you know yeah I'll keep you guys updated on that I'll do for sure a recap of like my, my first trimester how it's been I'll make sure to do a video with Ray that way y'all can hear his input how excited he is and all that stuff but yeah I'm just so nervous oh my god I don't know why it's like I'm pregnant for the first time all over again I just have like butterflies in my stomach well I have more than butterflies in my stomach but yeah I'm for sure gonna record especially because I want to make sure Ray gets to see the ultrasound or whatever it is that they're gonna do to me so yeah guys it makes me so nauseous just being this excited i'm so excited to start this journey and actually be able to vlog it with zeke i did a vlog record a lot i wouldn't say really vlog but it was kind of like me pretending like i was vlogging so i do have a lot of clips of me going to my my doctor visits and especially when i went into labor i have clips of that whenever my water broke whenever we were on our way to work uh we, when we were on our way to the hospital because fun fact if you don't know I, my water actually broke whenever i was at work ah! and um but yeah i recorded all of that i recorded when i got out of the hospital but i just never posted because i never really i don't know i never really i did have a youtube account but i never posted and i was just so shy and i was like people don't care like what i post blah blah, blah like I don't know so I never really posted it but I still have everything so maybe one day I'll post <laughs> but yeah it's so exciting that I actually get to vlog everything that way I can actually remember this experience and what I went through because this pregnancy was so tough so I can have a recap and be like girl sufriste mucho so you sure you want to do this again yeah I don't know I don't think so <laughs> but we shall see solo dios sabe so i'll keep you guys updated whenever i get there and i ojalá que todo salga bien en las manos de dios ponemos que este bebecito salga healthy whatever if it's a girl or a boy as long as it's a healthy baby that's all that matters because god knows how much ray and i prayed for this and here we are our prayers have been answered so I'm so excited and i'll see you guys once i'm there bye Not two babies. <laughs> no. <laughs> I was like, maybe I'm so nauseous because I have two babies. There's the baby's head. Wow, it's already big. There's some feet. Is it too early to actually like fill like little flutters? Yeah, a little early. It probably it might be even another four weeks before you're gonna really. Hey guys, so I'm already back at work and I was on the phone with Ray and I was just like telling him everything on how my visit went and ah! so yes, I am officially 12 weeks as of today. So I was just a day off according to my app. But, oh my goodness, we have an ultrasound. That's so exciting. So I told her, I was like, I'm pretty sure that, I, like, yes, for Malo Reve, like, you can see the baby, you saw its little legs. He was, I keep saying he because I feel like I saw it. I feel like it's a boy. I don't know. I just feel like it's a boy. But I might be wrong because I've never seen a girl ultrasound. But, that's why I keep calling it he. I don't know if it's a boy or girl. But anyways, um, what was his name? 
Yes, el bebé ya está formado. It looks it's so cute. And officially 12 weeks. I'm so excited. I really, really like this doctor. And I hope things go well. But it was a lot of information because I am already, you know, 12 weeks. So I'm almost pretty much out of my first trimester. We're about to be out of my first trimester. And it was a lot of information for them to have to tell me. And they took blood work and they, um, you know, did the urine test, pelvic exam. They did ultrasound and oh my goodness, they did everything. They did a lot today. So my first visit was very long. But I... I'm so excited guys. I'm so freaking excited. I told you I was like, are you sure we can wait till 20 weeks whenever they do the anatomy scan to find out if we're having a boy or a girl? Because we do have an option to do the genetic testing to find out and we'll find out within seven days if it's a girl or a boy. But I don't know. Oh my goodness. I'm so excited. I can't wait to announce to the world, gritarle a todo el mundo, I'm pregnant. But y'all have to wait a little longer. But yeah guys i think we will be taking a trip si dios quiere uh we're gonna go on vacation in a few weeks and hopefully by then i will be able to announce that we are pregnant but but i'm pretty sure si dios quiere that's gonna happen but yeah guys i'm so excited i didn't record much just because uh i was just having you know like private conversation with the doctor about my things that i was worried about and you know concerns and all that stuff but um i feel a lot better now that i've seen the doctor and now that i know my baby is okay the baby was moving a lot oh my goodness the little jelly bean gummy bear because yeah like i said está informado. he's just i can't keep saying he I need to call this baby something. On uh, my app, I have it as Bebecito. Same thing. It's a boy. I have it under a boy. But, um, yeah. So, my little frijolito. That's what I'm going to call it. Uh, my little frijolito was moving a lot. The doctor was like, wow. Like, the baby is very active. It was just, like, moving around. His little feet. Y las manitas and everything. It, like... It was just so perfect. I'm so happy. I finally was able to get seen today. Guys, I'm so excited. Can you tell? Because I'm so excited. So I sent my sisters the pictures of the ultrasound. And I gave them the heart rate. Also, the heart rate was, I believe, 143. Let me see. Oh, I didn't see. But I think the heart rate was 143. And I sent my sisters the pictures of the ultrasound and they swear it's a girl. I sent it to my mom and she's like, es niño porque está muy formado on the ultrasound. And I was like, mom, I was like, you don't know that. Like, I've heard that before. Solo Dios sabe if it's a girl or boy. But yeah, guys, I'm so freaking excited. I can't wait for you guys to find out. I can't wait for the world to find out that we are having baby number two. I'm so excited, guys. I know I've said that so many times. But yeah guys i'm gonna go ahead and end up today's video here because like i said i am back at work i just went to go do this um uh, visit real quick and i'm gonna go ahead and go back to work so i really hope you guys enjoyed this little video i don't know if i'm gonna add any more to it um any more clips afterwards like i said i think i want to do a sit down video with ray to so y'all could see his like reaction and all that stuff what he thinks if it's a girl boy blah blah but that will be a separate video. But yeah, guys, I will see you guys on my next video. Don't forget to give this video a big thumbs up. Subscribe to my channel if you have not already. Because, girl, you're already here. So might as well. And I'll see you guys on my next vlog. Bye.